the marketing team. You've met throughout the campaign, Lee Morris, Daryl Wickham. We've also have Alan and Natalie somewhere in the crowd to assist you with your purchase here tonight. If you have any questions regarding the property, the paperwork, or some technical advice with your bidding, they are here to help. Now, first I draw attention to is the contract sale, which has been made available to you prior to today's auction and on, that, uh, on display for the last 30 minutes. Very straightforward auction contract. Two parts of it form the frame of your competition here today. Uh, the particular sale together with both general and special conditions. Attached to that is the vendor statement, which is more commonly known as a section 32 document that outlines all the relevant information you need to know in terms of becoming the new owner of this property right here. Now, the particular sale risk as follow the marketing agent for owner here today is Raywa Real Estate, and the property we sell is commonly known to you and I, your neighbours, your postman, and your Uber is the delivery driver, simply as Unit 2, 412 Scoresby Road here in Country Gully. We sell an auction conditions today. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you are the successful purchaser, at the conclusion of today's auction, we're going to need two things from you. One is your autograph on the dotted line in the contract sale. Two, 10% equivalent to the purchase price here today as your deposit. We well, understand not everyone has a checkbook anymore. If you do, simply write a check payable to Raywire Real Estate. Otherwise, conditional, there is no cooling off period. Now, as your auctioneer, it's my duty and responsibility to ensure today's auction is conducted in accordance with the rules or any additional conditions that's made available for inspection prior to today's auction. The rules previous bidder try to prevent others from bidding, false bidding, major disruptions by bidders and their advice for these comebacks. Bidders will be any kind of request as the, uh, me as the auctioneer and by law, only I as the auctioneer can make a bid on behalf of the vendor and the terms I will use when I do so will be simply vendor bid. And by law, only I as the auctioneer can do so. And buyers, if you like me to want to sign one of these, in the next 15 to 20 minutes time, please pay particular attention to the next two rules because they are crucial for your success here today. One, by law, as the auctioneer, I cannot accept any piece of offers that's made after I declared property sold. So before I knock it down to the successful purchaser here today, I'll simply call out three times, like so. First call, second call, third and final call, and once the property has been knocked down, I can't take any more bids. And lastly, the owner has a reserve price. In the event, if we fall short of that reserve, by law, only the last bidder will have that first opportunity to buy this property at our owner's reserve. Now, ladies and gentlemen, welcome again. Here at Unit 2, 412 Scoresby Road, Infantry Gully. Doesn't matter if you're a first home buyer looking for a low maintenance lifestyle, but also give you the size and functionality and taking an advantage of everything this particular pocket of a Fentry Gali has to offer right here on your doorstep, this would be the perfect suit for you. Or a downsizer. Just like I said, you don't want to compromise on your living area, on the size of your living area, and a single story, which is rare to find in today's market anymore. This would be the property that you wanted to call home in the next many years to come. And an investor, you want to take an advantage of the boiling hot rental market at the moment. This offers you that opportunity. In terms of location, we're only moments away from Westfield Knox, both the primary, secondary, public and private schools, parklands, golf courses down the road. There's nothing better than here. And the property itself, I think everyone who walks through the doors in the last four weeks would agree with the statement I'm about to make. What a wonderful, well, immaculate condition our owner has offered for the next owner to move straight in or put it through on the rental market. Three bedrooms, timber floor in the living areas, newish carpeting all the bedrooms, up to the kitchen, both cooling and heating, centralized cooling and heating. And not to mention a sizable backyard which is rare for a unit of this size. But buyers, you know this already, and that's why you are here at seven past three on a sunny Saturday afternoon. I know it's cold, I don't want to ramble on. Well, I'll get it started very soon, but just one thing let me touch on before I start a bidding. Imagine this very hour next Saturday, if you buy this property today, you wouldn't worry what kind
not a crazy weather Melbourne throw at you anymore. And as a matter of fact, if it's a sunny like this, you can do all kinds of activities you, you want to do on a Saturday afternoon like this. Instead of standing on a curbside at another auction or go to another open for inspection because you bought your Saturday back today. But if you don't, you're back to square one. Whether you want to do that and who's going to be the one to buy their Saturday back in time to find out, in your hands now, ladies and gentlemen, you two are 4 412 Scosby Road. Where do we see a fair reasonable even had been? In your hands now. Oh, 520, welcome to you, sir. 500 at $20,000. That's rolling $20,000 rise. I, don't, I think that's only fair. At 520, your bid, sir. At $520,000, who's going to take me to 540? At 540, welcome to you, sir. At 540, that's your competition. At 540, 40, I've got to leave. You've got to pay more attention. At 540, over here against your opening bidder. At $540,000, take me to 60. Eighty to five eighty, new bidder there to five eighty. Take me to six at five hundred eighty thousand dollars. Third opening bidder and gentlemen over here six hundred twenty. Yeah. All right, you asked nicely. I'll take ten to five ninety. Five ninety with the opening bidder at five hundred ninety thousand dollars against you. Six hundred. And welcome to you, sir, mama. Six hundred thousand dollars. Four of you in and out of. $600,000, six with all the zeros against you, opening bidder, 10 or better bid, will put you back to the driver's seat. That's $600,000, where do we go? That's $600,000, are we done? Certainly not at this level, S60 is the bid. That's $600,000, are we all done? First time, that's $600,000. That's the winning bid, gentlemen, holds the key. Where do we go? Five, seven, 10. Hold the five yet at six hundred thousand dollars. Still searching for the ten. Opening bidder and over here at six hundred thousand. Are we all down? Finished and silent here, calling second time at six hundred thousand. Are we done? Finished. Ten. I can refuse to bid, sir. Ten. Ten. Welcome back. That's the spirit. At six hundred and ten thousand dollars against you here. Six ten. Call it six twenty. At six ten. That's the winning bid. Gentlemen, holds the key now. At six hundred and ten thousand dollars with you. At six ten. Are we all done? Finished. It's silent here. First call. At six hundred and ten thousand dollars with the gentleman over here. Another five. Ten. Five. <laughs> Alright, I'll take the five. Same opportunity, sir. 615, quarter 620. 615 with them at 615. That's $615,000. Beast there. Also here. And opening bidder. Five or better bid. We'll put you back to the driver's seat. That's $615,000. Are we done? 15 is the winning bit now. At 615, attempt your backing, sir. Call a 620. At $615,000. Start counting. First time. 620. Welcome back, sir. At $620,000. Six two zero. That's the winning bit now. At six hundred and twenty thousand dollars Are we done? Finished and silent. 625. 30, sir. 625. That's 625,000. 625. You heard it, man. We are on the market selling at $625,000. Wait for keep now, sir. And against you and over here, opening bidder. At $625,000. 627. 27 it is. At 627. From yard, quarter 630. At 627, that's the winning bid now. At $627,000. Are we done? Just to check over here as well. At $627,000, we're on the market selling. First time. 630, well, 31. Straight back at 631. At 631,000. 
Precise, sir. 35, good beard. Precise, sir, 635,000. First call has $635,000. 36. 36. Ones and six three. That's six three six. Second call has $640,000. Are we done? Finished and silent at $640,000. Two calls passed, one remaining. Where do we go? $640,000. Bits here. Here as well. Are you still with me? At $640,000. Are we all done? For the third and final call at six hundred and forty thousand dollars. Are you sure? Yeah. I'll reset the clock. Last three calls and three calls only. Once the gamble hits the contract, I can't take any more bids. At six hundred and forty thousand dollars. Once, twice, three times. At six hundred and forty thousand dollars, we are selling. <laughs> selling. Now, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for the new owner. It is sold. Congratulations. Well bought. Commiseration goes to the underbidders. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you again for attending another successful Ray Wagon Wavy auction. Enjoy your weekend. Yeah, I can